have a, a, a quick uh, prophecy uh, update here. Uh, as you know, things are really moving fast uh, in the world today. Uh, since we gave uh, the prophecy uh, about the two horsemen uh, prophecy. Uh, and if you want to listen to that prophecy, uh, you can uh, watch that down on the description on the link below. Uh, I believe that that prophecy is beginning to unfold uh, where the Lord showed me that we are entering into a season of war. Um, and, you know, in that prophecy, I talked about fires, uh, fires, red fires all over the place. Um, and we're already seeing a lot of uh, skirmishes going on uh, in the world, uh, you know, especially in the Middle East area. Now, I want to shift our focus again to another prophetic word that I believe that we need to begin to engage in prayer. Um, today, um, October uh, the 10th, uh, 2023, uh, the Lord spoke to me about Pope Francis. Pope Francis. And so this is going to be directed at Pope Francis. Now, there's going to be an assassination attempt on the life of the current Pope. Uh, the security around him must be beefed up. His inner circle is already compromised. There's a crisis within the Catholic Church that will lead to an inward implosion and scandals. The Vatican will be riddled with scandals and doctrine of fights that will lead to division and splits. The Pope should be careful where the Pope should be careful what he says publicly and where he goes to going forward. He has to understand that his words are going to have consequences. I also heard that the Pope was voted in to correct the historical uh, miasma uh, within the Catholic Church but he has slept on the same bed that stinks and is sympathizing with those who are already holding on to that stink so there's a threat to the Vatican those in charge with security should be extra careful in this season Again, this is a warning for Pope Francis to be very careful about the things he says publicly and the places that he goes to. There is danger in the Vatican.